Foxconn says its first manufacturing plant here will employ up to 1,500 people. Local leaders say they're pleased that manufacturing is part of Foxconn's plans here. However, some local residents say they still aren't sold. In just a couple months, this multi-purpose building on Foxconn's campus will no longer stand alone as the company plans to construct a sprawling manufacturing facility to make small LCD screens. Rich Scholzen of Racine says it's a sign Foxconn will succeed. Because it would help the economy around here and, I mean, build up, build up the city and a lot of work for people. Catherine Foster remains skeptical after months of mixed signals whether the Taiwanese company would stick to its promise of manufacturing in Wisconsin. We just don't believe a lot of the words anymore. Racine County Executive Jonathan Delagrave admits he was anxious to see what Foxconn had in store for the first phase of its $10 billion project. Now he's satisfied in knowing manufacturing is part of the equation. Manufacturing was the key component here, and that's why we're so excited. The building is known as a Generation 6 factory, which usually makes display screens for smaller devices. Foxconn originally said it would build a Generation 10.5 facility for larger screens. Foxconn added the shakeup came after economic uncertainty for those products here in the states. They're the experts in this area that know what the market can support, and if Gen 6 has a greater amount of market opportunity, Albeit, we're happy as long as the core things for Racine County are covered. Foxconn says its first manufacturing plant will be up and running by the end of 2020. At Foxconn, Ben Jordan, today's TMJ4.